I'm a professional Rainbow Six player, and this is why I'm using breach charges instead of grenades on gridlock. Firstly, I had to get out of the spawn and get to the cocktail rappel, which is where I encountered my first enemy looking under the door frame. Luckily, he was trash though, and I took him out pretty easily. Next, I'll head to the roof, throw a drone down, see what's going on, and look what we have here. In my books, that's a free kill, but for whatever reason, Sledge didn't open the hatches, so I guess I'll have to do that too, but this isn't what the breach charges are for, they come later. After taking out a third enemy on red stairs, it's time to take the site, which only requires me to absolutely slam the player and cocktail, which wasn't too hard. Now that it's down to the 1v1, it's time to finally see what those breach charges can do. After throwing some tracks down, the defender can no longer push up on me while I'm planting the bomb, allowing me to get it down easily. Then with the breach charges, I can open the floor around the bomb along with the hatch and play from below for the post plan. I can be extra safe by going into reading so that he doesn't kill me through my own holes, and all I have to do now is wait. Taking just a little too long and not being able to find me, I take him out for the ace.